Caddis Maxwell's here. This is going to be a short video. This is the Proto 6563. These aren't that old because they have the word professional. Old Protos from like the 50s say Proto Los Angeles. And then they were just Proto. And then after a while they added the word professional to them. So I suspect these are at the oldest from the 70s. Dust cap. So these are wheel hub dust cap pliers. Main, it used to be on older cars from the 50s, 60s, 70s. You'd have the dust caps to protect the uh, wheel bearings. But really, you don't have that kind of, those kind of hub designs anymore, except for on trailers. That's where I see them the most, and that's where these are still valid, is for servicing trailer bearings and getting those dust caps off. These aren't to be confused with wheel weight pliers. Wheel weight pliers have a different jaw shape to pry off the wheel weights and have... Uh, sections in them to adjust the wheel weight clips although most wheel weights are now stick on not rim mounted these are for removing dust caps they have a two kind of semi rounded jaws where you can get on the edge of the dust cap try to pry it off if you do have a hub cap for automotive use that's what this uh, pry bar here is to actually remove the hub cap so that you can use these to remove the dust cap. And then you have a little welded hammer section to hammer them back on. This rivet is actually not a defect. There's a flat so that this rivet cannot rotate in this bottom section of the handle. Only the upper section can move. What I mean by the dust caps is these things right here. These metal caps that you usually see on the hubs of like boat trailers or just general trailers. That's what these pliers are for is for gripping around that little lip and working that thing off. The few times I've had to work with them because of the way that it sticks out, usually I just use a socket, maybe a deep well or a short well, stick it down over one of the nuts, and then I just use a rolling head pry bar, kind of tap it under the lip, and then use a rolling head pry bar on one side and then the other to work off the cap. But it's always nice to actually have the right tool for the job. The only thing that seems interesting is a 6563 number. It seems that Proto may have discontinued these pliers or changed the part number and continued the 6563 number as wheel weight pliers. Because when I was searching around online, pliers like these and pliers of this style, Protos, were both listed as 6563s, when obviously they're not the same tool. But once again, it's just kind of nice to have a dedicated tool that's just for dealing with those dust caps, being able to grip them nice uh, and securely, and then be able to just work them back and forth to finally to get them off just in a more controlled fashion and less fiddling around using like, you know, pry bars. Sometimes you use a straight pry bar that you get way off on the edge of the wheel. Something like this, you can just grab a hold of it Get some nice secure grip and then you just work it off so anyway just wanted to make a little video because you this is a set of pliers that you really don't see that often which is wheel hub dust cap pliers and of course how i find tools is a tool like this seems a little bit uh, unique and to a lot of people when tools like this kind of rusty old weird set of pliers are in a bin People charge us a couple, three bucks because they think it's just a rusty old set of weird pliers. And all it takes is when you find those bins of old random tools, just take a look. Sometimes they're nice tools like this old set of protos. Anyway, see you next time.